All right, guys, today I have a very special product to show you guys. This is the Apple Vision Pro Developer Strap. As you can see, it's got a picture of the Vision Pro Developer Strap on the front of the box. We have written here on the side, Apple Vision Pro Developer Strap. Check it out, guys. This was $2.99 from the Apple Developer Store. Let's get into the box. We've got this nice orange pull tab for once, not green. There we go. Now let's get our first look at the Apple Vision Pro Developer Strap. All right, so here's the box. Designed by Apple in California with your very familiar Apple Pencil-like paperwork. And as you can see in the box, we get the developer strap itself with another Apple Vision Pro extraction tool. I have so many of these at this point, it's ridiculous. Let's get this out of the box. Take a look at it. So here we have it. Here's the audio strap. We got the speaker right there. And this one actually has the funny lightning connector on both because it uses more pins, I'm assuming, for the data of the Type-C port. But yeah, guys, this is the Apple Vision Pro developer strap. Let's get it installed on my Apple Vision Pro and we'll talk about it. Put this to the side. Let's remove the old audio strap from the Vision Pro. All right, so first, you want to put your front cover on your Apple Vision Pro so you can lay it like this without scratching the front. And we want to remove the solo nip band, remove the light seal and the light seal cushion. And you'll see the developer strap replaces the right audio strap. So it's this one we need to take out. And you see right there, there's a little SIM hole right there. We need to place the Apple Vision Pro extraction tool in that hole, push down, and also pull the audio strap out at the same time. All right, here we have our Apple Vision Pro extraction tool. We're gonna use this to remove the right audio strap right now. And boom, just like that, the old audio strap is out. As you can see on this side, it has no pins. On this side, it has pins. Let's take a look at the developer strap. As you can see, has two more pins on the front than the regular audio strap, and the same amount of pins on the back, whereas the retail, Regular audio strap has no pins on the back. Now to install this, all we need is take our Vision Pro, line up the audio strap with the slot, just like that, and just push down. The audio strap is now installed on my Vision Pro. When you have it properly seated, you'll hear two clicks and it will go in very easily. This is what it looks like on the Vision Pro. Now let's reattach our light seal and light seal cushion. And finally, let's reattach our solo knit band. Boom. We are good to go, ladies and gentlemen. This was your first look at the Apple Vision Pro developer strap. Now, what can you do with this? Well, obviously this gives you a hardline USB-C connection that you can use to update firmware downgrade firmware. You can also connect it to Reality Composer Pro and record 4K screen captures. When you do it with the built-in screen recording on the OS, it limits you to 1080p 30. Now, why did I buy this? I bought this because I plan on updating my Vision Pro to Vision OS 2 when the beta comes out on Monday. Or the only way to downgrade or upgrade your Vision Pro with a hardline connection is with this developer strap. So why did I buy this? I bought this so I could downgrade back to Vision OS 1 after I show you guys all the new features in Vision OS 2. And yeah guys, this has been your first look at the Apple Vision Pro developer strap. See you guys later.